You know, some mornings I wake up, I think I've died and this is heaven, Tom. <laughs> I mean, the wives and the kids camped out by the valley, huh? Not being moved on. Sure, me, myself. I'm surrounded by maids and food and booze. <laughs> you see that line there? No. That's the edge of heaven. The border between Birmingham and Paradise. And today, my friend, you're going to step over that line back into the world. You mean you have something for me to do, Tom? Have you ever heard of Hampton Court Palace, Johnny? No, I can't say I have. You and three families of the Lees are going to set up camp 100 yards from the gates of the palace. You won't be moved on because I've just bought the land. You'll be joined by some old friends of mine who are going to open a hole underneath your tents and caravans. You see this blow to the head you took, Tom? And for allowing the hole to be dug, you'll get £5,000, which you will split between the three league families. I take a lot of this money to do with not asking questions, Tommy. Dead right, Johnny. And when the hole is filled in again, you can go back to paradise. Mr. Shelby, your brothers are here. And there's someone who described himself as the Wandering Jew. Will you take the Jewish gentleman to the drawing room? Take my brothers to the kitchen and give them tea and rum. <clears throat> yes, sir.